So, this trailer debuted like hours ago and it's still trending in the United States in the top 10 on Twitter. I'm impressed and if I were Warner Brothers, I'd be downright delighted because of course one of the stars of this film is the new Batman. I'd be like, get that indie cred, Robert Pattinson, eat it up so you can use it to help my Batman movie. Uh, I'm still not convinced that Robert Pattinson is a great actor. I think that he allows himself to be the clay of great filmmakers or at least respected indie filmmakers, even if maybe some, some of us aren't a fan of their work. I mean, I, I hated The Rover. I thought it was absolutely horrible. But it, was, it paved the way for where Pattinson finds himself today. Um, and I think that he has a cool look, like in the stills that I've seen for this, uh, I mean, with that handlebar mustache, that jawline, being all dirty like that, uh, you know, his gaunt face and those big eyes, you know, it's kind of hard to mess that up. You know, you're, you're pretty much, uh, you know, that's like a slam dunk no matter what happens in the movie. And then speaking of the way the movie looks, I'm so happy that people are, dis are discovering, for many people the first time, the beautiful uh, aspects of black and white cinematography. I mean, so many wonderful classic films do wonders with the medium. Uh, if you think this is impressive, well, there's a lot of really great black and white movies waiting for you. All right, so let's take a look at The Lighthouse. At the very least, it's gonna get a cinematography nomination, you know. Tell me. What's a timber man want with being a wiki? Just looking to earn a living. It's like any man. Starting new. On the run. Keeping secrets, are you? No, sir. Why just spill your beans? Just cut a very dashing figure. Why just fill your beans? Why just fill your beans? rock. Five weeks, two days, help me to recollect. So, we'll see. I think it looks very good, but I don't really get a good feel of the story. Uh, I mean, if you look at these older black and white movies, they're not only beautiful in terms of cinematography, but they have really wonderful stories. The story here, I'm not sure. I think that it might be one of those, I mean, I can't, well, it could actually rely on visuals alone, but it's not gonna be as strong a package as if it has, as if it were to have strong visuals and strong story. But I think this is, you know what? I don't think a lot of people are gonna see this movie, to be honest with you. It's just too niche, but I think the right people will see it. It'll make them like Robert Pattinson more. His legend will grow. Uh, and it puts him in a really good spot for uh, Batman. So that's my thoughts on this trailer. I'm curious to hear your thoughts down below. Uh, and of course, as always, you can check out some more videos right now.